Hello and welcome to Scottish Car Enthusiasts and Trains TV and it's part 6 of our Bring Back Max Power series where we're taking a look at the May 1999 edition of Max Power magazine. So why not grab a brew or a cold beverage or a beer and follow the read along with me. So we finished up in the Max um, uh, buying power guide and we kick off today with an advert for SPAX. So let's see who the major stockists were in Scotland. And we don't have any in Scotland, unfortunately. So the next thing we've got is an arm plate armour plate lock protection. So if, if you were like a huge ice install in the back of your car, you didn't like the thought of somebody breaking into your car, you can get these locks. It would just go over the locks of your car door. You usually see, sort of see them on full transit vans or sort of thing. And you've got a Nathaniel F2 spoiler. Turbo Z. is an electronic turbo or supercharging device. It gives a aspirated injection engine a higher BHP and torque output. Fresh 10k boost and then we've got R and A splitters, spoilers and diffusers. Up we have an X-side solar battery charger. Even ZV1 tyre, Max Power Lottery, a Blitz and Pretzer kit, Sports Tech Seat kit, then we've got an advert for Scorpion Exhausts with the lovely Joe Guest, then we continue with a double page spread with Joe Guest. It was actually an advert for Motec uh, and not Scorpion. Motec are Scorpion specialists. So body kits wise you've got usual, you've got your Renault Clio, your Saxo, Civic CRX, Megan, Renault 19, Swift, Suzuki Swift, Impreza, Renault 5 Turbo, Fiat Uno and Fiat Cinquecento. You've got body kits for Vectras, Novas, Corsas, Fiesta, Escort, you've got the Calibra, Astra, Cavalier, Mondeo, Audi, Golf, 205, 106, 306, BMW 3 Series. So very well catered for if you have one of the following cars. Then if you wanted an alloy wheel, there's plenty of choice from Team Dynamics, Wolf Race, uh, da -da -da, Momo, TSW, Rondell, Oz. Before moving on to the the tits or the tuning industry troubleshooters. So you've got Frank the R Wrench Mank, huge J teams, style and expert, Cliff Tinker, and Sylvester J. Montagu the second. This where readers wrote in with queries like relating to cars, um, cruising, ice, safety, you sort of name it. Oh, look, there's an Allegro. 
Then we'll have an advert for DC Cook Motorsport. Now I'm sure DC Cook are also a car dealer as well. Can anybody confirm that? If so, why don't you add a comment in the comment section below? I've got a funny feeling they were a car car sales uh, team as well. Then we have an advert for Auto Excess. We deal in like um, alloys, exhausts, steering wheels, suspension, KNN induction kits. A very selection of um, modified goodies are there for your pride and joy. Then we have an advert for Peter Maiden Components. It's a double page spread for all Vauxhall and Peugeot owners. And Citroens as well. So let's have a look at some of the stuff you could get. You could get Cavalier Crucials. So it's a, you can make yourself a Cavalier lookalike. Stuff for your Vauxhall Tigra, Lexus style lights for your Corsa, um, twin headlights, the Euro look. Peter Maiden Components Power Packs, performance parts for Vauxhall, Peugeot, and Golf. That's interesting though. So they also do like, we'll just take the Golf for example here. So you've got sports suspension for your Mark II Golf. There, yeah, so you've got, you've got IBAC, Jamex, non stainless exhausts for Vauxhall, Peugeot, and Golf, Jam Speed exhausts, Peco, Powerflex. Next up we have a double page spread for Demon Tweaks and we all love to get in the Demon Tweaks catalogue, didn't we? Um, I've got a couple of Demon Tweaks catalogues somewhere in the house. So again, you've got a various selection of wheels, tyres, steering wheels, um, accessories like um, alloy filler caps, um, alloy pedals, the body kit for a Renault Megane Coupe. DTM splitters. Clear indicators, clear side repeaters. Fancy DTM style door mirrors. There's a free catalogue there. It's not really free, you phone that number. Well, as I was saying, it was a free catalogue, but I'm guessing when you phoned an 0906 number, yes, you'd have to pay 50 pence a minute. Calls should last no longer than one and a half minutes. You're looking at about £1.50 for the catalogue. Back in the day. Next up, we have an advert for Extreme Motorsport. Again, like Demon Tweaks and Peter Maiden components. Just specialists in alloy wheels um, and car styling part. And if you're wondering why we've got the envelope over the page slightly, it's because there is a nips alert. So Extreme Motorsport had a coffee and coke bar, coke as in Coca-Cola, a nine screen video wall and high tech fitting bays. And they were based down in Harville. I'm guessing that's an Essex if I'm wind right. Next up, so let's talk about power. Want some extra power from your standard engine? Don't know where to start? Fret no more, here's the score. So let's see if, how we can get more torque from your engine. 
before that we've got an advert for Pro Sport where style meets performance. So again, you've got the alloy or stick on in, uh, racing caps for your, your fuel flap door. You've got dials, techo exhausts, bonnet vents, light conversions, um, uh, da -da -da, indicators, dimmer fuel cap trims. So if you didn't have a, a dimmer kit, you could get the dimmer fuel cap trim. So moving over, natural aspirated. So you could have for a natural aspirated engine, you could have like an exhaust, super chip, uh, an induction kit, uh, piggyback ECU, uh, vernier pulleys, and racing fast road cam. Next up, we've got an advert for the TSW Evo R wheel. Did anybody have these on their cars back in the day? And if you were looking for a 15 inch one, you were looking at about £104.95 a corner. Sorry, not a corner, each for one of these wheels. So, what can you do to turbocharged cars? So, first of all, you've got an adjustable boost controller. You need some um, race tech engine oil, a dumper valve, and an uprated head gasket is what Max Power recommend. Again, a little advert for 10k boost. We have an advert for Animal Magic. It's a uh, mongoose exhausts. Collins Performance Engineering down in Cheshire. So what else would you need for turbocharging? For your turbocharged ride to make it go quicker. Again, you've got your filter. You've got, a, you've got your cams. You've got a turbo chip and an exhaust as well and what looks like another blitz electronic tuning system down there as well perhaps you have a supercharged car and again you'll need things like chip, an exhaust, upgrade head gasket, paper cam pulleys, um, fast road cams. And diesel cars. Okay, so you're probably wondering why we haven't covered diesel cars in a big way. Well, there's some bad news. At this point, there's no, there are so few tuning goodies available. It's amazing to think that a few years later, there'd be all sorts of like, tuning things for your diesel, like tuning boxes, remaps. Because uh, there's some very quick diesels out, out there nowadays. So you've got wheelbase, so again, alloy wheel specialists, TSW, Antera. And they're based near Manchester, I think. There's some more wheels as well, like the, the replica wheels from the BMW, uh, Porsche, I'm sure we have Mercedes as well. A great selection of wheels. You also had specialised in Kony suspension, Ibex springs, Spacks, Pirelli tyres, Yokohama Tarox, Remus exhaust systems. And there was always the case if you couldn't afford the alloy wheels at the time, or any of the parts, they were offering like finance over like 12, 18, or 24 months. 
you could you could still buy like alloy wheels and just pair them up monthly and they still look very cool in the car park with your fancy new wheels. Next up we have a double page spread for Lark Speed Performance Zone. Again, alloy wheels, um, dimmer fuel caps, splitters, uh, door sill covers, turbo power plus kit, power packages, um, jan speed exhausts, magnets, Sparkle, Pioneer, Instant Finance, Flexipan. Flexi plan. So another another company offering finance. So if you could, as I said, if you couldn't afford a set of fancy wheels, you could pay it up monthly over two years. Anyhow, I think we shall end on this Lark Speed um, double page spread. And I'd just like to thank you for watching. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe to Scottish Car Enthusiasts and Trains TV. And we'll be back with part 7 very shortly. Farewell.